Now, I know everybody's been having fun with this whole Diddy allegations and the raids and all of that, but I kind of want to bring up a couple of points real quick. For one, do not let this distract you from the fact that there was more than just Diddy and celebrities caught in those parties. There was people who hold positions of power in our government, and when they seized that information, they was really collecting for them. For two, this is election year. We have a lot of stuff that hasn't been done that our, pre our current president has promised us. Promises that he made when he first got in office, but it seems like he's more interested in sending money all over the goddamn world except to the American people. We have seen the cost of everything go up and quadruple more than it was during COVID, during 2020. That's not a lie. That's a fact. And I don't care what side you are. Whenever someone promises things to get in the office and they don't do them, they shouldn't be still in office. You shouldn't reelect them either. It isn't about what side you're on. It's about what policies affect us for better or worse. And like I said in the video, I'm going to test it here. Pick your policy, not your person. Okay? Keep your ears and your eyes on the swivel. Don't let anything or anybody distract you. Remember, these people are put here for entertainment, to entertain. You shouldn't live your life based on what they have going on. Now, yeah, I use it to make content because it's pretty fucking funny. <laughs> but at the same time, if you're in the black community, you've known this shit about Diddy for years, bro. And let's just keep it a buck. He a small fish. He's not even the big fish. The big fish are the people who sent them folks to his house. You follow me? Now, I ain't going to say too much. I'm going to just say, again, focus on what's really important. Don't be distracted by entertainment. You understand? The Romans had a way to do this. If the people started getting uh, uneasy and angry and were starting to turn against them, they take them to the Coliseum, put on a big show so everybody feels a part. They would entertain the masses and that would pacify them long enough. So that they couldn't revolt. Or at least it would change their mind in, into revolting. Because distractions are the best way to control a group of society who isn't very well educated and doesn't understand what's happening. And remember, any society that wants its people purposefully ignorant, it does not have their best interests at heart, for one. For two, they are not a democracy in any form, shape, or fashion. They're a republic. They're a dictatorship. They are tyrants. Do you understand? So please stop being distracted by what these celebrities are doing and focus on what's happening in your immediate vicinity. Because remember, we have a lot of stuff coming up and we need to get some of these people out of office. Now, I'm not going to tell you who should vote for. I'm not going to tell you what's the most important thing to vote for. All I'm going to tell you is if they don't match up with the best interests of you and your people, you shouldn't put that ballot in for them. Peace.